What was your science project? Can a lemon power a light bulb? How many lemon batteries does it take to power a LED light? I want to do a lemon battery because I saw a lemon with some wires and it was lighting up a light at my first grade science fair. So I decided to do that for this one. My hypothesis is I think a lemon can power a light and that one lemon battery can light a light. Okay, so if it was cut up into four and then we stuck zinc, well, zinc and copper into them, inside would be acid. And the zinc and copper would create a chemical reaction, which the chemical reaction turns into electrons that run through the wires. Then that turns into electricity to power the light. Okay, so results is right down at the bottom. One lemon battery did not work. Two, no. Three, maybe. But four, it worked. And you can see that we have a little picture to show that all four work together to power the light. How much voltage does a lemon battery put out? 0 0.9 volts. It takes four lemon batteries to power an LED, not just one whole lemon battery. And the most fun was using the voltmeter. And my dad taught me how to use the voltmeter. Then we, then I got to measure a 9 volt and a 1.5 volt battery. And then when we figured out one did not have enough volts to power the LED, then we tried two. It still didn't work to power the LED. We tried three. We couldn't tell if it could power the LED, but then when we added a fourth, it totally worked. And it had enough voltage to power the LED. And how do you use a voltmeter? Well, you have to know which side is um, negative and which side is positive. That should be the first thing you should know. And what colors go with which? Red goes with positive, black goes with negative. And which was positive of copper and zinc? Well, copper was the positive and zinc was the negative. 